Hello guys, Samsung Electronics has repeatedly accidentally leaked the Galaxy Note 9 via China, Colombia, the FCC, and lost one unit which resulted on the first hands-on review. But now Samsung has gone one step further and put the phone on its website. Every the T Samsung support pages only list the Galaxy Note 9 by its model number but that matters little given we already know the major details about the phone including its large display, additional storage, the RAM and the massive battery. The bad news is that this will increase the heaviness and thickness of the Galaxy Note 9 compared to the Galaxy Note 8. The in-display fingerprint sensor has been postponed onto the more exciting Galaxy S10. The most exciting thing about the Galaxy Note 9 is not the phone itself, how the S Pen will work. This alone may well be enough for many users to upgrade, especially the combination with the long overdue big battery upgrade. Samsung has said that the Galaxy Note 9 will focus heavily on the S Pen. The Note 9's S Pen is going to include Bluetooth, suggesting remote control features. Valic does not say what features exactly, but rumors say it might control music playback and timers. It is not certain what the Note 9 will be like, although it's still expected to carry a Snapdragon 485 chip and the next generation Big Spy. But knowing how the company works, we wouldn't be surprised if the camera or display are upgraded as well. All we have to do is wait for August 9th to see what Samsung has to offer. Thank you so much for watching guys. If you liked the video, make sure you give it a like. If you want more content, make sure you subscribe. Again, thank you for watching. And I'll see you later.